it's something else. Oh boy. Here we go. He walks down fly. Once it's been the a long city time. used to pulse with energy. Mirror's edge. Dangerous, but alive and wonderful. I figured how or now, why. It's something else. I remember when this game first the came out. Came slowly at first. I played the demo and then Most immediately bought realize, it, like, very soon. Like, right after. And accepted them. They chose a comfortable life. Some did. I don't remember how I got, I don't remember how I got it, and though. I remember, I, remember I got it. I say I bought it, but I don't remember if I bought it or if it was a gift. Criminalized. Or if I rented it. And just beat the whole thing. We call ourselves runners. We exist on the edge between the gloss and the reality. The mirror's edge. We keep out of trouble, out of sight, and the cops don't bother us. Runners see the city in a different way. They see the flow. Look at this. It's become pathways and conduits. A good video game. And escape. An intro. The flow is what keeps us running. Didn't need free sales or the free order. Didn't even have famous celebrities in it. Train of time, face. Yeah, I know you hate it. It somehow released complete. Like finished, like you bought it and you city. had the whole game. Check out these new training grounds. Pretty slick, huh? So let's not run around, dude. So get these were magical times. The okay. And we are gonna play through the tutorial because I am rusty. I don't even want to get into all the things I just went through to get it like this. Like, this is quality. This is once again another game that, like, wasn't optimized all the way for PC. Like, even the, um, uh, screen sizes, I had to go in there and fandangle the actual, like, config settings and save it in, like, the notepad to get it to, like, 1920. Oops. Oh, well, this is death. <laughs> What is it? 1980 by 1050, right? Standard, standard widescreen now, standard screen. Yeah, it wasn't even an option in the options menu. And don't get me started. Like, it, you might still see some performance issues here and there. Hi, Faith. Welcome back. We'll be seeing you so soon. Look at this. Celeste. I'm coming for that. Hoorah! Oh, well, this is death again. See, this is why we need to practice. I was trying to edit the slide speed. Hoo What's the plan now, Celeste? What's the tricks of the book? Yeah, I don't even want to get into it now. I'm too excited to actually be playing it. Oh, 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 oh! oh. Oh, was I supposed to jump off of it? Hold on, how do I... Hua! Well, that's death again. I just want to practice, man. I know I kind of succeeded, but I wanted to actually succeed it. Hua! Hold on. Yeah. Right trigger to get through the doors. Oh, I forgot about that. You slam jam your way through doors. Oh, hey. <laughs> Don't you shake those digital hips at me, girlfriend. There you go. There you go. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. Talked about this already. Up. Up, Faith. Have faith in yourself. This was also like the very first parkour game I ever played. Like that had this like built into it, then later on there was like, uh, Titanfall, and, uh, what was it even called? Brink? Brink had, like, a system for certain characters, I think. But let's not talk about Brink. I don't know why. We're, we're enjoying ourselves right now. We're having a good time. <laughs> we're playing a good game. There's no need to remind ourselves of past mistakes. Alright. And hoo -ah. Well, you have to do it on the upswing. Yeah. I'm gonna go up higher. Leap! You call that a leap? You call that a leap, Faith? Wait, what are we doing? Oh, we got a shimmy! Oh no! This game, at its time, the graphics, people saw it and were like, oh! 
The touch, the feel of cotton. The fabric of our lives. Alright, that one's gonna take me a while. Celeste, do you have to show off so much? Faith just got over an injury. Now we're doing this. Left over, it's a combo move. Left over, right over, left over. It's quick, it's quick. The three quick presses will get you up here. Wall run, turn, and jump is a very useful combination of moves. So like that. Uh, jump, slap. Wait, if I jump. Oh, that's the turnaround. I'm wall running, then I do the turnaround. I forgot, it's the 180. This is back in the day when game said 180. And <laughs> you can literally, you can leap and then turn around and land on your back and then shoot. Bah, 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 bah. Look at you stay prone like this. Like, this is just a cool mechanic. I, I was hoping more shooting games would include that. Like, I remember, when it called Duty, what was it called? Like, the dolphin dive? Like, you would leap like a freak and then crouch and go all the way to prone. Like, <laughs> I don't know which came first. Alright, let's try this. Ow! Ow! You gotta start wall running first, that's right. You can't just, you can't just spin around on the wall. Let me go... Aww, oh, it's not that hard. It's not that hard when you're this good. Alright, alright, alright. And now, shimmy. It should automatically latch. Yeah, here we go. Carefully walk around the ledge. Later on, people will shoot at us while we do this. Alright, Celeste is just doing the most over there, alright? Was that the pipe making a sound? Not to mention, look at this. Look how... Look how lived in... Look how filled up this place is. Granted, it's very, like, a monochrome. It's got, like, this very, like drab future dull look going for it and then like but then there's like the striking colors that pop out to like give it its own sense of style kind of like like portal one the first time you played through it like everything is just like white and then all the things that you interact with are labeled clearly but there's something really nice about it also like if you look in the background you can see like cars doing their thing right down there well not really Kind of reminds me of, oh, there they go. There they go. Who are they all in butt to? Where are they going? Is that a pile of trash or it's a tree? It's a very gray tree down there. Anyhow. Kind of reminds me of, like, the beginning of, like, Prey. But the one that was, like, made for, like, Xbox. Like, the new one. Not the old one with Tommy. The old one with Tommy was amazing. Hold on. How do I dismount? Left? Ah! I did it. It was, like, instinct. I think I saw left trigger for a split second. And then I run up here. Alright, Celeste, why don't you give me a hard one? Oh, to coil up. Yes, I was practicing this. You leap like a freak, and then you pull your legs up. Then you leap like a freak again, and you coil up. Left trigger to do a right. I held left trigger. I did. Now I walked into the barbed wire that's behind me, <laughs> didn't I? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, the razor wire, I should say. Oh, left trigger. Hold it. When you get close to the ground, that's the problem. You gotta get... Oh, and then... Oh. No. I definitely need to practice on this. When close to the ground, it says when close to the ground. Hello, Billy. It works. I swear this controller ain't that bad. Hoopa stink. Contemporary. Hoopa schmetten. See, it works, but then I gotta do it. Close to the ground. I got it. Got, like, where's the perfect time for it to work, dude? All right, leap, hold, hold, leap, hold. Still failure because I did it too early. Now, leap, hold. Hi. Right. I don't even know where I'm at now. I'm on a ledge. Oh, we're just not gonna. We're just gonna let this one pass. You know what? That that should have counted. I think that should have counted. All right, now. All right, now. No. Hey. <laughs> what do you want? What do you want, game? I, I, I was experiencing this earlier. I, I think it's the controller. Because this controller is like modern, and it doesn't have like the same like trigger acceleration. Because I remembered, I could remember you could like 
go up to like a ledge or like an edge you know what i mean and like only peek out a little bit because you really, like you do like a half trigger pull but like there's only like the full trigger pull i think that's the problem we're running into here everyone hold i have a theory a working theory i'm gonna switch controllers everyone hold up be right back Okay. All right. The thing about it. math, science, and history. Ignore her. Faith. Faith's having a good time. Let's just. I'm gonna pause that. Unplug it so that it stops registering it. There you go. Ignore. Notice how I switched to mouse and keyboard real fast. Okay. All right. This is my nicer Turtle Beach controller. I've just been using that one just because I like the color. Right, okay, same thing. Not, I mean, you don't really get that half squeeze right there. But, what happened to Lola? Oh, I missed. I forgot, X is like bullet time. You get so much bullet time, I accidentally hit it. Alright, you gotta... Hua, hua. Nope, that's still not it. <laughs> maybe maybe it's just me, maybe I'm just stupid. There it is. When do, when do you want me to do it? When do you want me to do it? Give me the green light. Give me, I'm holding it, I'm touching it. Alright. Oh, I know what I'm doing wrong. I'm supposed to, They want me to actually like, slide off. Or just run off. I'm very confused. Run off! What am I doing wrong, Ricky Bobby? I keep on going for it. Where's the information? We're just gonna walk off. Free me. Free me from my curse. This is how the game ends right here. This is how This is how Mirror's Edge goes. <laughs> the game just decides, you know what? I feel you pushing left trigger, but you don't seem to mean it. Like there I could do it, but it's too high. If I bullet time it, right? No. I think I can bullet time it. All right, you, you got to use up all the bullet time, though. I'm thinking what I'm thinking. Hold on. Hold to roll when close to the ground. Swing out the landing. See, this is the problem with this tutorial. This is a good tutorial. I liked it the first time I played it, but now that I've gotten older and crummier and gripier, you know what I mean? Complaining, ah, oh, young people, they didn't video game like us. I can't practice that, I, there's no button for me to go, all right, let me practice that move, which is fine because like, honestly, I think the best practice is actually just getting into the game and doing it over and over again. By the way, all the things I had to do and change just to set this game up so that it would run properly and look nice. Man, the messed up part is, uh, as I was online looking for solutions, I found out that I'm going to have to do similar things for Mirror's Edge Catalyst, or Mir Mirror's Edge 2, as the laymen call it. Mercury yes, Celeste? You know, oh, I forgot about this. I forgot about right? the whole fighting part. Okay, come on. Eat it, Celeste! <laughs> you want me to... I ain't. That was very suggestive by the way. I was like, wait, what's Celeste doing? Is Faith and Celeste about to get personal? <laughs> and then this one, I love this. Reminds me so much of fear. Get that. Feed that. Oh. You gotta do it just right. Hold on. Hold. Ha! 
Oh, that one breaks their guard. You can string together different moves and attacks. This will make you more effective in combat. Oh, once I get warmed up, I really want to switch back. Because like, that's the reason I switched to the other controller. Like, as much as I love this controller, this is not a new one. I haven't bought a new one in a while. I got that one, and I'm feeling, I'm feeling how loose the left thumbstick is. Hold on, ET problems. You don't care. <laughs> Irrelevancy. Right, ET. Oh, God. <laughs> then she pulled out her gun. Give me that. Give me that. No. That's the last. Now I have the gun. To fire, use right trigger. Don't hit Celeste. <laughs> Why not? Why not, bro? It's a nice cool 1911. Oh, it's loaded, Celeste. Why? Why'd you bring a loaded gun to this practice? It's like, it's gotta be real fear, right? Celeste says, it's gotta be real bullets. Otherwise, you'll never learn. Let's drop this. Remember what I taught you, Faith. Isolate them. Fight them one at a time if you gotta right. fight. From in front of this arm, when the weapon turns red, timing is very important. All right, so I gotta use my, I gotta use my, what's it called? My runner skill. Ah, and he's, why do you have to slap her on the back of the head? Which is the practice one. How come I automatically disarmed it? X inch slow-mo, your extra time is available. Blue reticle, it makes it easier to disarm hostile enemies. Ooh, <laughs> slap, bap. <laughs> Why are you giving why are you giving Celeste neck right there? Why are you saying neck and giving her their old slaps? Back from the nineties okay, someone did stupid training, in school. The they'd say thing. neck and they would slap the back of your neck. And then they it became like you remember like the, the whole like circle with your hand going. below your waist game? See you later, Faith. It was like connected to that. Like you would look at it, <laughs> if you looked down and saw the circle man made the okay A okay symbol aim down, they'd say, ah, neck. You're stupid for looking. You're stupid that your instincts for motion and actions, or for the fact that I lulled you, I tricked you, I literally lied to you. I'm your friend. I'm like, hey, look down there. How dare you trust me? This such that you have to think about it. It's such a childish, stupid thing. Dice game. That's uh, that's not good. That's let's ignore that for now. EA also to the top left at the beginning. Also, mm, used to not mean anything. It used to be, hey, okay, EA made this. And then all of a sudden, after a while, before the dark times, before the Empire, now it's like, ooh, EA, it's you. But this was a good game, so. They, they had some good times. <laughs> but when I was looking this up, and like, on Reddit, people were like, they ever fix... They ever release a patch or Mirror's Edge to fix the stuttering and lag during cutscenes? And it was posted like <laughs> eight years ago. And one of the other comments is, uh, no, but there should be a patch coming out yeah, soon. Yeah, let, me, let me know. I'll let you know when it comes out. And that, like, that was like the end of the thread. And just like, ah, uh, no, they never did. They just didn't give a, give a hoot. They polluted. Oh, God. Do they have to include the squishy sound? Oh man, what a way to like... Re if you had a phobia of heights, this thing is the worst. Like, like people are afraid of like games with spiders in it and they have to have the anti-spider mode. There was no quick death mode. There was no quick reset mode for Mirror's Edge. You had to hear that the sound of the wind and Faith going squishies. It's like, man, that's kind of rude, dude. I, I did it that time, whatever. Whatever, I can't practice that. All right, let's just move on. Let's move on. Move, move, move on. Move on, Faith. What are we doing? I forgot. What's the objective? Be cool. Be cool. Run on things. Be the best. Gotcha. I'll do it. Yes. Tag them and bag them. There was hustle speed runs. I thought that was cool. The way they people would do it. There are different techniques for being the awesomest at Mirror's Edge. Ah, oh, Hoopa Stank up there. I was hoping Mirror's Edge would stay big, kind of like Portal, you know what I mean? Because like, there's like a puzzle element to this that I really enjoyed. Now, how do I get up there? How do I be cool? How do I make Faith seem like she knows what she's doing? There we go. Yep. 
There we go. Yeah, nothing. Cat like instincts. Special shoes. If I look down where I see the cops right by. You're taking your sweet old time, so let's get pissed. She's almost at the comps tower and you ain't. Get moving and give her the bag. Cell will take it from there. I did that wall run, okay. Celeste's getting pissed. How do you think I feel, buddy boy? Oops. Do they have to include the smush? <laughs> it bothers me so much. Like, Lord. Alright, so what you want to do... What? <laughs> Welcome to Ewok Templar. Get used to that sound. Get used to the sound of winning in a non-vertical way. What? Am I supposed to push a button? I could have swore I auto grab, right? Right? The tutorial would be nice. Okay, I grabbed it that time, but then immediately released it with left trigger. If left trigger is grab, but also release, that's mean. That is mean. I could have sworn, like, I mean, that's down. This is up, right? Up. So if we go ups again, right? Logically speaking, if you went upsies again. Upsies! Maybe I should aim. You know what I mean? Maybe I'm the problem. Yeah. See, that's what I did the first time. Then, for some reason, after that, it all just fell apart. Always slam jam the doors. Thank God the city has plenty of red paint to keep this place up to code. You, Sounds like some blues are headed your way. News chopper tipped them off. <laughs> You tell those news choppers to suck a lemon. Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. 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 Do I get to read that? Bags of hidden sta uh, and stash points to collect to discard the runners uh, running grill if it indicates a stash point is nearby. Anyone see L? Leave Mark, please. Something. Sorry, whoever. Whoa! Forgot about that. <clears throat> What's the point of grabbing those bags again? Because runners left them and I have to grab them? You should always try to get away from hostiles. Don't try to be a hero, Faith. You're a runner, not a murder murder machine. Uh oh. No. Oh, the bag is the thing that run to the left because he, he tried to get out without it. I'm here to try to pick it up. <clears throat> I'm trying. They're shooting at me. They got the big bang bangs and they're using them against me. You there, Phil? Okay, alright, 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 alright. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm Faith. So everything's fine. <laughs> yes! Hmm, yeah, I see I'm getting better. Oh, 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 the bullets, the bullets are real. And... Ooh, loop and swoop. Ow. Oh, I fell down, I fell down, I fell down, I fell down. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm designed to fall. Science! This arm. No, wait. Oh, stop, stop. He's gonna kill me now. There it is. There it is. I'm not going for the pacifist run. You ready, Phil? Gotcha. Yep, I can see face. The now. pacifist run has been cancelled. <laughs> what? Huh? I did the pacifist run a long time ago. I'm not doing it again. <laughs> the stink. Okay, there we go. I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Stop yelling at me. <laughs> Stop talking to me calmly. Hey, Celeste. <clears throat> Good thing I don't have to do that myself. Could you imagine? They're playing rough cell. Excuse me. If I had to use the same controls that I've been using, 
to target throw. Oh, good. Gotta go. No, you don't want it. You gotta get off that roof, Nate. Don't care how you do it, just do it. I believe in magic. Yeah, young girl's hot. <laughs> yes, there we go. Hi. It's me. A female protagonist. That didn't need a big, huge arc. I noticed how she didn't need an actress on Twitter talking about how the story's gonna be different. The prince was not there to save him. I'll ask around. Get your ass back to base. Notice how she just started doing work and people enjoyed it. You notice how entire character trope wasn't saying that traditional values amongst other folk that aren't her are a weakness, right? They must be destroyed and altered. And it's like, how about you just do your thing and they do their thing? How about that? Huh? Is that so... Such a weird, hard concept, man. Say again, Officer Connors. Going to see hmm. Pope, Robert Pope. Taking a I dig on that style. Last week. Yeah, anyway, Stay at uh, home, play with cards. Drive, tell Lieutenant Miller. If they're yeah. if she was making that pair of card pyramid, I imagine cards. the gathering Thanks. cards would have been Hurry like up. looking in the mirror. Hello, sis. You there, kiddo? Hey, Mark. I bet you're listening to the chatter. You know me. We'll try and get some sleep. The demons. Gonna put the word out tomorrow. See why those blues got itchy trigger fingers. I'll drop by later, okay? And don't chuck that pizza. I like the top and sure. sure. Yeah, I know. See you, Mark. I actually like these cutscenes, the animated cutscenes. All units proceed to 56 West Arlen Drive immediately. Proceed with caution. Kate! Who are you? Kate, where are you? Yeah, Kate, what are you doing over there? Hey. Merc. You off? Just get on comms and track me. Yes. I liked it. I don't know why, but I liked it. It kind of hinted at, because it was a game first, right? Was it a novel? Was it a, was it a graphic novel first? I don't know. Now that I think about it, this seems like the type of game where it might have been a graphic novel first and then adapted to a game. And maybe that, like, them doing those cutscenes like that was like a callback to that, like a connection. Hmm. Anywho, I'm gonna do this one very similar to the way we were doing, um, uh, Quake. So the episodes will be random length because I'm gonna go mission by mission. This was the tutorial and the first mission, just put it to one. Next up, this thing, I believe this chapter is called Flight. But, anywho. Actually, you know what? I want to add a little bit of something to the end of this, just in case you're a Mirror's Edge fan and you own it on PC. And you're looking at this and you're wondering how... Because it's one of those games where, like, on newer, bigger, more powerful builds, those animated cutscenes in between missions have a lot of, like, stuttering and even audio cuts, audio stuttering. The way I fix it, and I think this is the way I fix it, is, like, at first... I went online and looked up everything I needed to do to get my resolution right. You have to actually go into the files. Hold on, let me pull it up. Let me, let me show you. Let me just show you guys real quick. Real quick, just for fun. Let's go on a little tour with ET. Let's get, let, I'm gonna let you all look a little bit behind the mirror. See the real, see the real, see the real nonsense. All right, so you're gonna go to uh, documents, right? Then EA Games, Mirror's Edge, ID, I, oh no, TID, TD Game, TD Game, capital T, lowercase d, game with a capital G. Then you're going to go to config, and then the first one, I'll show you now, this one, ID Engine, ba -bum. You go all the way down. One of the fixes for, like, just the gameplay altogether was to come in here, and you know, I, I thought about turning Bloom off, some people did it, but the first time I played through the game, it was on the Xbox, and Bloom was on, and you couldn't turn it off, and it wasn't that intrusive. Mirror's Edge... Mir, Mirror's Edge is... <clears throat> Mirror's Edge is Bloom wasn't as intrusive as other games bloom. All right, it wasn't like when Oblivion first released and like the flowers had their own glow. 
Uh, but where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Full screen. True. I saved it as false. This is the copy of the default ones, I believe. The default settings. But even in the default, I made sure to save this right here. This is where you can fix your resolution. Because, like, all the resolutions that are built into the game are different sizes of regular screens nowadays. So that's where you would type it in right here. 1920 by 1080 save it deal with it but then the other thing i did was inside of the game itself i made sure to turn vsync off and then turn it on in the video control panel and then last but not least i think this is the thing that really eliminated the stuttering problem in the cutscenes. i gave it a max frame rate for 60 because that was the max frame rate that they achieved in boosted graphics on the Xbox Series X. So I'm not sure if the game was ever optimized to be played above 60 frames per second, but as soon as I did that, I start, I noticed that the opening cutscene, no stutter, no lag, and I was very happy to see that that second cutscene leading into flight, also no stuttering, no audio problems. I was like, yes, I did it. I figured it out. Math, science, and history. But anywho, go ahead and cut this episode here. Sorry for anyone who wasn't interested in hearing about the backdrops and E.T. gamer problems, but I actually was a big fan of this game. And I actually really did like the graphics when it first went out. I mean, look at that water. It looks goofy now. But back in the day, the, the pre-rendered ray tracing of the buildings, I was like, whoa. Right now we're getting some like artifact like stuttering, shimmering in some of those distant pieces. Maybe because they're actual like... 3D objects that are out there to like give the effect of distance, which is actually kind of cool for back back when this came out. Like that means like that that junk is actually out there. Those those big white uh, cylinders and rectangles are actually over there, and those reflective surfaces of their glass. That's probably what the that's probably what that artifacting is. Is probably because those little tiny reflective surfaces. I'm willing to bet. But anywho, that's, that's irrelevant. I'm cheesing over this old game. Loving it already again. I should have cut this off a while ago. And that's what we're going to do. Thank you all. Hope you all enjoyed. Ewok Templar, we're going through Mirror's Edge. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting, and I'll see you on the next episode. Y'all take it easy. Oh, I fell down, I fell down, I fell down, I fell down. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. I'm designed to fall. Science! Hoo, hoo, ah. Disarm! No! Wait! Oh! So, so, ah. He's gonna kill me now. There it is! There it is! I'm not going for the pacifist run! Gotcha! The pacifist run has been cancelled! What? Huh?